Welcome to Unicorn Pension 301. Unicorn Pension, welcome to my crib. Let's check it out. Nah, this isn't my building. It's the building of my Oh, hi. Just reading a book in my sunroom. I uh, woke up a little bit early, um, have a few hours before school, so why don't you come in and check out my crib? So living here has been wonderful. Um, love my school, love my kids, love my home. Um, this is the view I get every morning. So over there is the main road leading down to the coast. That's the second building of the Unicorn Pension Complex. That over there is the water and Songhat Sun as well. I hiked up there my first weekend here. And the coconut groves, uh, the rice fields of course, because it's the boonies. Uh, that's the laundry room. And there's my scooter. And here it is. Yeah, you can see there's my bed. There's the um, wall of Korea. Um, I like to study up on uh, geography sometimes just to figure out where's the next best spot to check out. Uh, maybe a temple or like a famous tourist attraction. Uh, Korea is pretty big. There's a lot to see and it's well worth visiting. Is at your feet. The pretty girls are calling you. They all sound sweet. Oh, hi. Just doing some lesson planning before class. Uh, yep, this is my workstation. Uh, here, take a look. Yep, you can see the computer, the big um, low table here. Gotta stretch my legs for sure. And um, yeah, some paper and pen, a glue stick. All right, enough work. Uh, let's see, here's my other map uh, of the room. I really like to decorate the room with maps. Um, just a map of my island. I live, uh, there's the city and where the airport is. I live right about here. Um, this is where the resorts are, and that's the uh, special um, Sanbang San that you see so much of. Um, it's great, it's a little island, but it has a lot to offer. Check out uh, my second balcony. Alright, open that up. Ah, breath of fresh air. There's the coconut grove. The sun sets literally right over there. You can see the pink and the purple hues of the sun setting. Um, it's beautiful. Love it. So I don't have a walk-in closet and uh, pretty much I don't have a closet at all except for this dresser here. So let's open up and see what's inside. be wondering why I have all these post-it notes um, all along the walls of my house here. Um, it's actually frequent little reminders of what I need to do for the day or helpful hints. Uh, like, let's take a look here. This one, times around the world. When it's 9 o'clock in the morning in Korea, it's 10 in the morning in Aussie land, uh, 5 in the afternoon in Vancouver, 8 p.m. in Toronto, 8 in the morning in Hong Kong, 9 same time as in Japan, and 1 in the morning in the UK. Come on, next I'll show you the kitchen here. 
Uh, you can see it's not very big, uh, definitely just enough for one person. I have my essential oil, soy sauce, sesame oil, and pepper. Uh, my two gas stoves, pots and pans, uh, my lovely drying rack, and my extraware stuff. Um, cups, sugar, sink, you know, the whole deal. So I know in cribs, everybody shows you their refrigerator. So let's see what's inside. All right, so don't be scared. Ta-da! It's a small refrigerator, really. Uh, let's see, we got the Jeju oranges. Got that from my school. Um, some milk, about to expire. Um, some condiments for my ice cream. A um, few drinks for my friends when they ever visit. Um, some Jeju orange juice, and this is what I'm very proud of. Honey lemon tea. If you know me, you know why I like it. Um, next, uh, we got some uh, random little Tupperware stuff. This is really good uh, with rice and uh, either that or pour some soy sauce. It makes a great sauce for dumplings. Uh, this stuff, I love mixing that with soju. Um, we got some kimchi, a big bucket of kimchi there. My natto for my kimchi fried rice. And some veggies, onions, cucumbers, which go great with that sauce up there again. And these sesame leaves are so good. With the barbecued meat in it, you just kind of like peel it open like that. Ta-da! Wrap it up and eat it like a taco. Alright, let's check out the freezer. This is the certificate you get after completing um, talk orientation. Ta-da! Not much in here, um, but what's inside is quite good. Um, this is frozen cheesecake. Hard to find. Um, let's see, vanilla ice cream, of course. Not as good as back home, but um, something. And then, ta-da! What is this? This is Japche pan fried spring rolls. I can't wait to try this out. Comes in a package of two. So it should be fun. And of course, some ice cream, some lovely dessert after um, dinner. Uh, this is a good one. It's a soft co uh, ice cream sandwich. Um, right, something else that I'm super proud of my crib is this massive high ceiling. Look at that. It's I don't know if you can catch it in video, but it's such a high ceiling. I feel literally like I live in a loft. It's great. Living the life. Alright, so you've seen my kitchen, you've seen my sunrooms, and you've seen where I work. So next, um, this is my washroom, my small but dainty washroom. Check it out. Alright, it's kind of colorful, I guess. Um, so, hello everybody. I love this. Having the glass screen helps a lot with the water splashing because, as you can see, there's no tubs. It's just one big shower and basically um, water gets everywhere. It's a tiny washroom, but I like it. Alright, so let's head outside and check out what else there is. This, uh, two weeks into arriving on Jeju, I love this thing. Um, it's called the Venus. <laughs> Check this out. Venus. So where do I put all of my helmets and whatever stuff I need for that day when I'm taking my scooter? Let me show you.
All right, so we're outside and um, welcome, please welcome the newest resident of um, my house. <laughs> uh, no, the horse doesn't live here, but literally it's, here I'll show you, it's right across from where I live. So instead of a rooster waking me up, sometimes um, the horse wakes me up.